right now I got my lunch cooking. Eli is working on his workbook. Molly and Ben are over here wrapping up their schoolwork. So that oh, way me. they, I know you're doing great. That way they can go play outside. Wheezy is uh, chilling. Theodore is on guard duty. He likes to watch out the window to see if any dogs are walking down the street and keeps the bus, keeps the bus safe. Where's Kevin? Oh, Kevin likes to lay on my freshly made bed and mess up my pillows. Huh, Kevster? Is that what you like to do? You like to mess up my bed? Yeah. So yeah, I do, Mom. I love to mess up your bed. Makes me feel real good. I've got a special treat for you because we're gonna hop on the bike in just a little bit after lunch and we've gotta go ride somewhere. I'm gonna be on a podcast. The person that's doing the podcast actually is a full-time RVer and they are in the park. So I'm gonna ride my bike over there and you're gonna get a great seat on the front of the bike. Finish school with the kiddos and I'll pick you back up. It's like we're running in circles Going around every day Getting stuck in the hurdles Of yesterday Don't you wanna go further Away from the fray Let's not get stuck in our worries We'll make our way Won't you come outside Where the sunflowers bloom Breathe in the air Hey, how is it going? We are gonna set up for cooking with Kyle because today is Tuesday and we've got to cook. Tomorrow's Molly's birthday and she asked us not to film on her birthday. So we're filming tonight and you get to see how I set everything up. First, I grab my light from underneath the bench and I get to open it up. One second. So we just use one light. We don't need both of them but the light goes behind the camera. And then I gotta get the light that's in here, the actual light bulb. I take the light bulb and screw it in here. We take the cap that goes over the front and it gets Velcroed on. We've got our light, but that's not the only thing I have to set up. I have got to come down here and get the tripod. Grab our big camera out of here, put it down. Then I've got to get my laptop, set that up. I've got to get what we call our switcher, so that way we have multiple camera angles. And this one. Now I've got to attach the camera, this camera, to the stand. Hey, I haven't seen you guys today. Um, so we got cooking with Kyle here in less than an hour. I don't care how many times a day we do dishes. Every time I come to the sink, it's full of dishes. So I got to get those dishes done, get my whole area you know, cooking in a tiny space, even over here. We have a lot of stuff. We're a large family, so we gotta figure out, we gotta set it up for cooking with Kyle, so we try to clear as much off as we can to get ready for the show in less than an hour. So I gotta put this down, get to work, so we can see you guys at Cooking with Kyle in just a few minutes. Here's what we've got. We've got the camera on the tripod, and I have to set up the fan because the camera overheats if I don't because it's plugged in to the HDMI. We've got the computer already up and going. We've got the switcher hooked up. And then this light, once we get done, or once we're ready to start, I put the light right behind the camera. So that 
handsome fella back there can be all lit up. This camera over here is our additional camera. My phone will go in here and that sits on top of the water purifier. Kyle's getting done with dishes. How much do you love doing dishes? I think we do them three times a day. Now that this is all set up, I can go ahead and switch over to the premiere. So we're gonna watch the premiere and then we are going to go directly into cooking with Kyle. The kitchen setup, I just need to bring the light over here and then we're good to go. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Cooking with Kyle. I'm Kyle Bethune with Red, White, and Bethune. Where I am an average dude just cooking food with you guys for about 30, 45 minutes. We're gonna do a crunch wrap supreme. How is that finished crunch wrap? It's freaking good. You're hitting home runs with uh, Taco Bell replica meals. I yeah, never even worked at Taco Bell. How's your How's your crunch wrap? It's really good. Ooh. I don't add salsa like him and you, Mom. I'm a basic person. You like it simple? Yeah, I do. There's nothing wrong with that. I've got Kyle made me my special one over here, so I'm going to put my special sour cream and salsa on it and then get to eating. Now that dinner is done, I'm going to need your help because we have a tradition of decorating the kids bunks for their birthday and Molly's birthday is tomorrow. So check this out. Kyle picked up some decorations today. We have got some streamers. We've got a happy birthday banner. We have 10 balloon we have a another happy birthday banner and we've got some awesome balloons and we have got to get them put up into molly's bunk so let's get started arizona garden stucco in the heat let me take you dancing let me get you on your feet Arizona garden with my little cactus flower Let the day slip away in the golden hour We've got nothing but time and music And a sweet cold drink in the heat oh. Alright, would you like to see what we did for Molly's birthday? Take a look. We've got balloons up there. We have happy birthday, more balloons. Down the hallway, we've got some balloons. We decorated with happy birthday and some tassels. And you can't forget, she's 10 double digits. So let me text Kyle because he took her on a bike ride. So let me text Kyle and have him bring her in. Oh my gosh. Happy birthday. Oh my gosh. Thank you. What do you think? Daddy picked him up today. So. Oh, wow. You're doing pretty good, Daddy. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Are they cool? You got to go look at your bunk. Oh my gosh. This oh. looks so cool. One, zero. That's so cool. Thank you, Mom and Dad. You're, you're welcome. Looks pretty cool, right? Uh-huh. Happy birthday. Thank you. But now it's that fun time of night where the puppies want to go. You want to go putties? Who wants to go putties? And they're off. I know this was kind of a short one, but we have good reason. We've got a birthday girl that is turning 10 years old tomorrow. So we have got to get to bed, get showers, do all the things, but I'm so glad that you came along with us for our short little day. And the next time you see us, we're gonna be rolling, like moving. 
we're moving spots to a completely different location. Don't forget to check out We Plus 3's video. We have a huge giveaway, huge giveaway. Details are in the description below. And uh, thanks for walking the dogs with us. We'll see you later. Sierra J. Chapman has been missing since December 27th, 2022. The FBI Cincinnati Field Office is assisting the Dayton Police Department in Ohio with their search for Sierra J. Chapman. Chapman was last seen during the early morning hours of December 27th, 2022 at an Autumn Woods Drive apartment in Trotwood, Ohio. Chapman was reported missing on December 29th, 2022, and on January 6, 2023, police found her 2014 Cadillac SRX SUV in Middletown, Ohio. Her purse and other personal items were located inside the vehicle. However, Chapman has not been located. Anyone with information related to the disappearance of Sierra J. Chapman is asked to call the Dayton Police Department at 937-333-COPS. Let's work together to bring Sierra home. Get the smoke detector off of yeah. the thing. Get the smoke detector ready because I guarantee you it's going to go off. Right, let's get this browning over here. Let's get our beans going again. I'm going to, you know, cooking in a small space you use, have multiple uses for your little appliances. So I'm going to be using my rice cooker to heat up beans. <laughs> Uh, Wonderful Revolution says crunch that like button, it'll make you feel supreme. You know, they don't get paid enough. <laughs>